I'm Ross Naddock with Van Onen Company with your closing comments for January 31st. Uh, today we had kind of a quiet day, um, a risk off day, I guess, in corn, soybeans, and wheat. Uh, you know, after technically approaching over, overbought conditions here in all three of those commodities yesterday, the market took today as an opportunity to take some profit out of out of that rally that we've had here over the last week. So corn finished down uh, just slightly here in the deferred contracts, the March contract unchanged on the day. Soybeans down about four and a half cents. Uh, they were down eight, nine cents here for a while. We had Chicago wheat down about five and a half cents. Minneapolis wheat was the biggest biggest uh, drop on the day at eight and three quarter cents lower. Kansas City wheat down two and a half. And live cattle here, we had a little softer day as well, some more profit taking going on there. Um, the cash trade uh, started up yesterday around 126, a dollar lower than the previous week. Um, cutout values were higher, however, on the day. Uh, in, in the middle of the day, we finished about 66 cents higher on the choice and select was up about 29 cents. Uh, we'll see where we come in here later, later in the session on the close. Um, otherwise, the pork, uh, we had the nearby February contract come all the way up to where cash is trading with lean hog index of about 73 bucks. And the deferred contracts, they're sitting at the bottom end of the range. I'll leave you with the disclaimer, past performance is not indicative of future results. Past performance of options trading involves risk of loss and is not suitable for all producers.